How to Save Store Values in Python An informative tutorial. In Python, there are various ways to save or store values depending on the type of data, the duration for which you need to store it, and how you intend to use it. Here's an overview of different methods to store values in Python. 1. In-memory storage. Variables. The simplest way to store data temporarily in Python is by using variables. Variables hold values in memory during the execution of a program. Once the program terminates, the data stored in these variables is lost. Data structures, lists. To store multiple items in a single variable, lists are mutable and can contain elements of different data types. Dictionaries, to store key value pairs. Dictionaries are also mutable and allow for quick lookups by key. Tuples, to store a fixed set of items. Unlike lists, tuples are immutable. Sets, to store unique elements without duplicates. 2. Persistent storage files. Text files store data as plain text. Common file formats include .txt, .csv, and .log. Text files are human-readable and can be used to store data in a structured format like CSV, comma-separated values. Binary files store data in binary format. This is useful for non-text data like images or executable files. Databases, a lightweight database that comes built in with Python. It allows you to create, read, update, and delete data using SQL commands. MySQL, PostgreSQL, more robust database systems that require external libraries and can handle more complex data storage needs. Serialization, JavaScript object notation, a popular format for storing and exchanging data. It is easy to read and write for humans and machines. A Python-specific method for serializing and deserializing Python objects useful for storing complex Python data structures. Environment variables, used to store configuration settings and other important data that you don't want to hard code into your scripts. They are accessed through the environment of the operating system. Hash 3, external storage. Cloud storage. Services like Amazon S3, Google Cloud Storage, and Azure Blob Storage provide scalable storage solutions. They offer APIs that allow you to upload, download, and manage files in the cloud. Remote databases. Remote databases can be accessed via APIs or direct connections. They provide scalable solutions for storing large amounts of data. Choosing the right method. Temporary data. Use variables and in-memory data structures. Local storage. Use files, text or binary, or local databases like SQLite. Persistent and structured storage. Use databases, SQLite, MySQL, PostgreSQL, or serialization methods, JSON, Pickle. Configuration and sensitive data, use environment variables or secure cloud storage solutions. By understanding these different storage options, you can choose the best method to save and manage your data effectively in Python.